Welcome back to the Ghost Key in the SS Sinks a Lot. I am Gray, and today we're going to continue rumbling through this big ass boring boat of boringness. You know, I, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna lie to you. I, shit like this in these games kind of. I mean, I like battling and stuff, but man, this shit kind of bores me. Anyway, 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 anyway. Yeah, we're just rumbling through the caverns. Uh, caverns. Cabins, making sure, making sure there's no shit in here to pick up. Um, I'm not entirely sure where to go. Entirely. Oh, this fucker wants to go. All right, we'll do this. Um, because I'm, I'm kind of a loot fiend. I mean, I, I kind of do like picking up shit, even if it's some dumbass, you know, X accuracy. I think this is the asshole with all the fucking horses and shit. But anyway, um, I kind of, I kind of like picking up all that shit just for the simple fact, you, you know, just to have, not really just to have it, but just. For the simple fact that I know that I got it, just in case there was something stupid in next, I always do that. I'll play one of these games and go through and I'm like, ah, you know, I don't need to pick up everything or some stupid shit and leave one behind and and then you know, it's like, oh fuck, dumbass, you know, and you're looking for a specific TM and oh look at that, it's where you fucking left it in that place that you didn't pick up everything in because you were like, oh fuck it, I just want to get through here quick and not be thorough and just say fuck all that extra special shit. I've done that way too many times. Anyway. Um, yeah. We're on our way to go get HM Cut. We nabbed Brick Break in the last episode, which is what I really wanted, because that's, that's a pretty good skill to have. Um, so yeah, we gotta go find Mr. Sick Guy here and kill Wankers Radicate. And... Yeah, I'm not sure how far we got to go, so that may or may not happen in this episode. I'm not entirely sure, but anyway, I think today, um, some bulk recording, and I've told you guys that before, and blah, 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 blah. You know, I'm just gonna really go through and try and get through to through Vermillion. Oh, look at that, a dead end. So now we know that there's nothing else. Even us sailors have Pokemon too, which is, you know... Odd? Is that supposed to be odd? I, I don't. I don't know. And why are they all kind of tubby? I mean, do they all just sit around on their ass all the fucking time? They're like, oh, yeah, mom will say later. I got nothing to do but sit on my ass and catch tentacles and shit. Anyhow, you fucker. But at least we know now. At least we know now where to go heal these little bastards. You don't have to run around all afraid that a Pokemon are gonna friggin' faint and shit, and we'd have to handle a good old wanker with a whole two Pokemon. Which, I'm not gonna lie, speaking of uh, only having a couple Pokemon, it's kinda weird. It's kinda weird for me to be this far. I mean, I'm not really that far into the game, but it's weird for me to be that far, this far into the game, and not have a full party. It's kind of odd. Kind of odd, but you know, like I said, I'm I'm saving a spot for for Omanite, and I still have not decided what the fuck I I want for my last one. I mean, I, I don't know. I mean, if anyone's got some ideas out there, TM44. What the fuck was that? What was that? What is TM44? Oh, rest. Nifty. Though I never really used, I never really used that all that much. But anyway, what up, you want to fight? Hello, stranger. All right. All right. What do you got there, buddy? What do you got, Barney? Oh, and you brought this guy. Of course you did. Of course you brought. A tentacle. It really is one of the Pokemon that not necessarily I hate a lot. <sighs> it's just a Pokemon that I that just annoys me more than it should. I mean, I know a lot of people like it. I'm not gonna say it's bad. It's it's good. It's a solid Pokemon if you need a water. And I like its typing. I mean, I think the whole water poison thing. I like poison typing a lot. Even though I hate the color purple. Let's race release this fucker. Get your shit all fucked up. Oh yeah, we picked that up in the last episode, by the by, in case you didn't know that. But now you do, so fucking yeah. 
are you? Oh, shit. I think, I think Mechanic can straight up boss this guy. Just take it. And, yep. Hold it. And you're dead. Yep. Mm hmm. So, anyway, um. Wanker shouldn't be all that tough. Looking ahead, well, I haven't looked ahead, I'm just fucking talking, because, I mean, it's kind of what I'm supposed to fucking do, right? But anyway, Wanker ain't gonna be all that bad. He, he should be alright. I think his Pokemon haven't even leveled up all that much, if at all, since the last time we fought him, so I'm not really too terrified. I mean, this, with Stella having bossed as much as she has, I mean, it's, it's probably gonna be a pretty easy fight. Although that seismic toss there kind of worries me. Oh, okay, that's that's all right. You can get hurt by the poison because it's just gonna go put you in bed and, and it'll make it go away. But anyway, have I have I talked about uh, how I dislike the whole normal attribution to flying types? I don't remember. I don't even remember what generation they started that in. I want to say four or five when they started tagging all those flying Pokemon with normal types as well. It, it threw me for a fucking loop. Because here I am, you know, I'm, I guess you could say I'm old school, whatever. Ah, fucker! Figured there was going to be something in that goddamn can. You know, here I am, I guess you could say old school and shit, and, you know, I'm playing the game, and it's like, oh, fucking matchup. Alright, I got this guy. And then, you know, the thing like, one shot to my swallow or some dumb shit, and I'm like, what the hell? Why? Why does that end up being super effective? Because they tossed all that normal shit, which to me gave normal types an unnecessary, a very unnecessary um, weakness. Honestly, I believe I don't really believe in having, you know, these things, these Pokemon be be weak to what they're strong against. I don't like that at all. I mean, that just doesn't. Uh, that doesn't make any sense to I me. Mean, like the whole dragon thing. Why is dragon effective against dragon? I mean, and then you know, if you're gonna have it just be like, oh, dragon can only kick dragon's ass. It's like, okay, well that makes sense. You know, okay, fucking petra berries. I've never used that shit in my life. You know, that's okay. But then when they decide to like, well, oh yeah, they're 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 weak against ice and and fairy and all this other shit too. Oh, and then when they have all these extra other fucking typings, yeah, they're weak against those things, too. It's like, well, then you just get into, like, fucking shit all up, because, you know, now your shit is weak to fucking three-quarters of the Pokemon out there, which really hurts a lot of Pokemon, like Amara. Amara was a good Pokemon, but it's poor typing. It's poor typing just puts it in such a hurting position. I mean, it just it just really hurts to have it on your squad, because it's like, oh yeah, I got it, and it just gets its ass kicked all the time, because it's rock and ice, which makes it weak to, like, fucking seven types, which is way, way too many, in my opinion. But, yeah, I guess, what do you know, I mean, and I, you know, really don't know nothing when it comes to Pokemon, I guess, that I've only been playing it for fucking... 10, 15 years, whatever the fuck it is anymore. I don't really know. My conception of time and all these goddamn neighbors and their fucking lawnmowers every fucking day. I swear to God. I was bitching last episode about how much I was trying to get fucking recording and stuff. Now the neighbors start firing up all their fucking lawnmowers. God! Pisses me off. I mean, as if they haven't fucking mowed their lawn like three times this week already. It's like, fucking really? Do, do you need to do more? But anyhow. Back to the task at hand, Fisherman Dale. Look at that, and he brings this guy. Up oh, there he is. That guy. Fucking take this razor leaf. Your big red fucking jelly cranium, whatever the fuck that is. Get fucked, asshole. Anyhow. So, so you should remember that. I, I don't like fucking flying in normal pair. I think that's bullshit. And basically anything that's weak against itself. God damn, I hate these fucking neighbors. Anyway, what do we got here? A Goldeen. 
Yeah, fucking Goldie. Good old Goldie. That's something I like to see somebody using an LP. Maybe, uh, maybe I'll try and find me one of them. Oh, fuck! Speaking of, I think the... Oh, no, I think the old rod is in Vermilion. We need to go... Well, not really need to make sure we get that. Because you can only catch magic carp and shit like that with it. Which I've never understood why everyone likes magic carp and Gyarados. I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm just, maybe I'm just a grumpy fuck who doesn't like stuff that he sees too much of. And magic carp is like the most common Pokemon in the game. I mean, seriously, go to like Pokemon DB or whatever and. And look up, ah, fuck you and your shit, asshole. I'm gonna fucking sand attack you just for, because I'm a dick. Yeah, take that. That's probably what we're gonna do, though. When, when we go in the fucking fight, what's his nuts? Just go in there and sand attack the shit out of stuff. Especially that Raichu. I think that's what we're gonna try to do, because that. Now, Raichu's kinda mean. I really do need to actually get to looking at how uh, getting Dirt Machine evolved. I mean, it'd be nice to go in there with a sand slash, by the way. And fuck his shit up, not just hit it with a rock too. Oh, you fuck! God damn it. Ah, uh, now this is, this is pretty much guaranteed. Oh shit, it actually hit. I didn't expect that. I wonder if we can outspeed this fucker. Shit, I do have poison sting too. Forgot about that. Forgot about that. Uh, scratch, I'll just take him out. It's fine. Yeah, fuck you and your quick attack. Anyhow. Or was I? I forgot what I was fucking saying. But anyway, yeah, go, go to Pokemon DB and look at all the routes that you can find Magikarp in. I mean, the list is fucking huge. Stardust, I do not remember what Stardust is for. Holy shit. Um, well, yeah, we got more people in here. Got an old guy, a couple old guys. I'm gonna go fucking heal the Dirt Machine real quick and... Then we need to start putting the Dirt Machine out front so he can get in some, some leveling in place of Stella, because... I think we're gonna want him as close to sand slashing the shit out of stuff as possible. Cause yeah, we're gonna need I think we're gonna need a little bit of help for that or that right you. Just because of what you just saw there, I mean it's not because he's necessarily super greater, but he's a second evolution. Oops, wrong way. Going up against the first evolution and that can be that can be harmful to our health. Just I think I fucking written the wrong one again, didn't I? Yep. Alright, this old guy. Nope, nope, I'm not paying attention to what you're saying. Small trees can be- oh! But he didn't give us that, did he? Oh yeah, he's just telling us about that shit. I was gonna say, what the fuck? That was the weirdest way anyone's ever given me cut in my life. Well, I've seen weirder shit. Oh, this looks like a trap! Fucking got me. It's that fucking bitch again. Goddamn. Oh, a ratata. And I didn't put the dirt machine out here. Did you notice that? Uh -huh. Put the fucking cranker out here. Probably should really, really try and emphasize those two right now. Because, uh, well, maybe we'll try and ride them. Well, we're gonna. Definitely try and ride them when we fight Wanker because we get. I mean, he's all of this shit. I don't think he has anything level 20, to be honest with you. Pikachu. Fucking Pikachu. Alright, Dirt Machine. Oh, you bastard. What is with the fucking crits on this poor sand shrew right now? Jesus. It's like fucking everything's a goddamn crit. Holy shit. Can you quit with that? Oh shit, we outsped it. Um, that's something people don't realize. Sand shrew is a notoriously. is not a notoriously slow Pokemon, so he can. He's, he's pretty effective in the right situation. Look at that. The next day, I'm never gonna fucking use that. Oh no, I've been ambushed. Strong or a rare Pokemon? Actually, I prefer Pokemon that are defensively oriented. In other words, Pokemon that can take a hit or two and then return in kind, fucker. 
is that? I think I've said that in like every episode so far, but anyway, we're getting close to uh, needing to end this here in a second. That's such a cute little Growlithe. Aww. Yeah, yeah, that's all right. We can we can handle this. Alrighty, chuck that fucker. Get out. Ooh, a Ponyta. We haven't seen one of them yet. Yeah, we're really hurting for a water type right now. That's one thing. That's one thing we could use. Right? Let's try chop this fucker and see how far that gets us. Ooh, farther than I thought it would. Get out. Of course, you crit when you kill it. I mean, how how useful is that? Ooh, wow. Five hundred, and you didn't even fucking level. Holy shit. Holy shit. Anyway, I think that about wraps it up for this episode. Man, I'm just all fucking turned around here. That does it for this episode. Um, if you've made it this far on YouTube, you pretty much know the protocol. You know what to do. Thanks a lot for watching. And, you know, pants are optional or something, I guess. I'm just the king of awkward outros, aren't I? <laughs>